Good to go. We're live, I think. Anyway, hey guys, what's up? Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the stream. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, please tell me it's working. It's not working. Why is it not working? Oh, shoot. I think the, I didn't, I don't think I've connected the Xbox. Uh, I need to get an HDMI cable. I'll be back real quick. <laughs> Alright, I got the ACMI cable. Right here. Yeah, that was the problem. <laughs> Whoops. I forgot to connect uh, the Xbox. The Xbox. Anyway, what you guys been up to? Me, I've been okay. I've just been um, uh, going on weight loss stuff. Which is okay. Been making lots of recipes. You know, I've been cooking a lot. Nothing too, too special. But, um, I'm not very, not the best, uh, I'm being consistent, you guys can tell, to this stream. But yep, it's kind of how I look so far, let me see. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I feel like I've lost weight. Yeah, how do I look? Do I look like I've lost weight? I feel like I've lost weight. Lost uh, definitely a good 15 or 30 pounds. Still a big boy, but working on it. Working on it. Okay. Let's, uh, over here. Don't worry, guys. Every day my body reminds me that I'm a fat man. Every day. World does not stop for the big. But uh, for the most part, I've been okay. Um, I've been uh, tracking my calories. I've been uh, making different recipes. I made a pasta today that is like pretty well balanced. Um, uh, I've been using this egg yolk pasta. It's great. It's got some protein in it. Not ideal though, but I mean, it's 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 good. It's 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 tasty. <laughs> um, yeah. So the pasta I made today had uh, egg yolk pasta, which is pasta that I believe is made with egg whites. It had, um, which would, the reason why that's important is because normally pasta is really carb heavy and this is still carb heavy pasta, but it's, it's, the calories aren't nearly as much, not nearly as much. So for a pasta that has egg whites, uh, and carbs, when you mix in other like meats and sauces, like it's, it's really like fantastically, uh, well balanced, like it. Up one plate doesn't have an or a crazy amount of calories. It's tasty and it has a, a decent amount of protein, which is usually what I look for in a meal. Unfortunately, today I did stop by uh, McDonald's and got myself some breakfast burritos. That wasn't I should not have done that. They weren't even that good. I think that's my biggest issue right now, though, is that I'm kind of want to like try out these different fast foods. Some part of it is because I want to see. What kind of fat, fast foods can I eat that will stay within my diet? Like, what can I keep in my calorie goal? And other parts of it are like, oh, what um, what what else can uh, you know, what what else can I eat? Can I have a cheeseburger and a McChicken from McDonald's? Okay, is this is this putting me over the edge? Is this kind of within my calorie deficit? Um, here, let me see if I can show you guys. Uh window capture here oh that's not it <laughs> that's the Yu-Gi-Oh picture all right let me go to uh chronometer so you guys can actually see so i've been using chronometer to track my calories as well uh it's okay i mean most of these calorie tracking apps they're like estimates they're not like the end all be all but they're 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 decent, I guess. I mean, I don't I don't know. 
All right, so let's uh let's figure out what we want. Chronometer, here we go. Yeah, so you guys can kind of see right here. Uh, let me let me. I'm stretching it out. Oop, more, morb, morb. God, that Morbius meme is so out of control. Okay, so uh, let's see. Um, should probably uh, close. This. Let me close this. And close that. And close that. Uh. I'll leave that open. Okay, so what I got right now so far is this is what I ate today. Some leftover like beef stew that I made yesterday. That's okay. Um, for 335 calories, 35 grams of protein, that's not bad at all. Um, compare that to this pasta I made. Oh, oh, what the hell did I just do? Uh, which is 200. Oh, I moved it. Which is 200. This was 327 grams. And that had... Um, uh 24 grams of protein so technically the beef stew was probably more efficient in protein this while having more calories gave me a little bit less protein but hey uh you know if you're ever dieting you want to you want a protein heavy meal that's what you want to do well anyway so um then we uh we walked for 80 minutes i walked to starbucks and back i wanted starbucks but i didn't want the excuse of like not going to the gym i should have gone to the gym today but i also didn't go i, I wasn't feeling it I'll go tomorrow. Oh, I, I lift a lot of weights and I swim a lot. And today's just one of those days where I'm just like, I am fucking tired. Like, I am tired. All right. So we had beef stew, uh, meat, uh, uh, potatoes, carrots, uh, this blueberry uh, French toast that I made. Um, I weighed myself. I was at 234 pounds. That's good. Um, we'll show you. I'll show you what the graph is looking like in a bit. Got two breakfast burritos from Starbucks. Uh, got, uh, I mean, from McDonald's. Walked a lot. <laughs> Walked a lot. Uh, I, I feel like I maybe burned a little bit more than that calorie count, uh, but I, I can't tell. Hey, uh, hey, what's up, Griever? Streaming in 4K? Yeah, I know. Just going over my diet stuff. I'm going to play, I think, uh, DOA, and then I'm going to play um, Apex. Uh, I was playing uh, this. Uh, I was playing uh, Fae Tactics last night, though. Uh, still don't have a consistent streaming schedule. Probably won't for a while. So, you know, I I'm probably also going to restart Final Fantasy 13 at some point. Um, right now I'm just trying to get, you know, I'm trying to be healthy. I'm trying to get all my eggs in a basket. So let's see. And then I had my two plates of pasta, which, uh, these are honestly like good. These are just, these are, I would say these are just really well balanced for the most part. A good amount of carbs, a good amount of fat um uh okay amount of protein i wish it, i wish i could get more protein in there man uh, the hardest thing about uh dieting i think in my opinion is being able to get like consistent amount of proteins that is by far the the hardest thing to do like it's just it's it, it just doesn't I, do, I don't know how to consistently do it well anyway um here we go we got, uh, this is one of my calories. So you can kind of see the days where I kind of want to eat fast food. If I go over 3,000, that's not good. So I have out of one, two, three, what, wait, four. Yeah, so how many days is this so far? Oh, oh, whoa, 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 what the hell? No, 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 how do I back, oh, reset soon. Yeah. So we got, uh, that's the 28, so we got... We're starting on the on the second so this is 26 days out of these 26 days one two three four five six seven eight i got eight days out of these 26 days where i go over 3,000 calories that's not good yeah i mean yeah i mean uh, that's part of it it's just like i want to be uh healthier i want to lose weight so far i think i've i've i made a pretty big difference um uh, I started at 255 pounds. I'm at 234. I started tracking at 246, though. Like, when I noticed I was losing weight, I was like, oh, I should probably track it. Um, borrowed a PC from a friend. I'm saving to buy my own couple, uh, to buy my own in a couple months. Okay, that's awesome. That's great. Great friend that he let you borrow that. Honestly, that's fantastic. Um, if you play Final Fantasy 13 on a PC, if you're, if you don't do mods, uh, 
the Xbox version of it that launched on the Game Pass version of um, Xbox. That, I believe, is also the one that's on their console. It's like the fixed version, I guess, if you will. I don't know if the Xbox version... I'm pretty sure it runs at 60 FPS, though, where the console version is uh, locked at 30. Yeah, it's just at this point, I've just, I've, I just I started up Final Fantasy 13 too like two weeks ago, and I was just like, I should just restart this. I'm I, I haven't played this in like months at this point. But yeah, I've been uh, also start working a new job. I, I'm not gonna get paid a lot, but it's you know to do something to get more money. Um, then that uh, I start technically last week. I think my first paycheck is this Friday, but I think it's only gonna be like sixty dollars. <laughs> Let's see, thirteen times six. Yeah, that's like a little over seventy dollars. But yeah, this is how it looks so far. Yeah, n not many changes to the room. Everything's the same, but yeah, just okay. Here, I'm gonna take off my shirt just because I'm pretty sure I can on YouTube, dude. I better not. Can you take off your shirt during a live stream? Yeah. Well, either way, I'll be fine. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, so I'm clearly building more like muscle definition. Uh, uh, you can, as you can tell, let me send a little bit. Uh, I'm still fat. That's going to take a while to go, but getting more muscular. <sighs> oh, dude, I could be like Armstrong in Full Metal Alchemist. The Armstrong family. But yeah, but that's pretty much it. Just getting more muscular. Nothing, nothing too crazy. Once again, uh, if you follow my Instagram, I post like at least twice a week what my progress is. Doesn't look nearly as good. I, what I don't like is this fucking back, though. I need to... Hopefully when I lose weight, I'll lose some of this fucking humpback I got going on. It doesn't look too bad, I guess, when I'm standing straight. I, I, it's just... It's, that's been my posture forever. Yeah, man. That's a, that's a humpy-ass back. But... Let's see. Is my, is my stream down? I should check. Give me a second. Yeah, we're good. But yeah, let me see what how I look like when I uh, I haven't seen myself on camera in a while. So let me see. Ooh, that's as fast as I can get. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, there we go. It's like I'm pregnant. And then I could also do the chest bounce. I've always been able to do that. But I can just do it a little bit more now just because I am working out. But hey, man, that's a, that's a good thing about working out. Now let's put on a shirt before stripper music plays and the rest of my clothes comes off. But yeah, that's, uh, that's how I'm looking at. So that's kind of cool. I might do that every stream to show some progress just because I only stream like maybe once a month now. Um, but yeah, so this is my overall. So that was my calorie intake. So you can kind of see it go down. Um, this is what my weight loss is. When I started this up, I was at 240. And when I weighed myself today, I was at 234. So as you can see, guys, if you ever got into a uni project to support students that struggle with a particular subject i excel at basically i work about 12 hours a week and earn a bit of cash also flexible hours yeah and get another job or apply for internships yeah i'm gonna give this job like three months and then if i don't get more hours in three months i'm gonna be like okay um well we'll um at, at that point then we'll uh we'll look for a different job so when i started tracking on this app i was at 240 pounds um uh, I'm at 234 today, but it, by the way, if you ever try and lose weight or anyone tries to lose weight or even gain weight, this this is kind of what it looks like. It's just, it's not a, cons I mean, there's a trajectory here of it going down, but just keep in mind that your weight will fluctuate um, up and down, up and down. It, you'll, some days you'll weigh a lot and then it'll just drop down and it just, it, your weight fluctuates all the time and your weight fluctuates all the time depending on how much water you're drinking, depending on how much fluids you have depending on um, what, like whether you do little twitches or flick your fingers. Like there's so many things you do that burn calories that you don't think about. Um, but yeah, this is kind of what the graph we're looking at. I expect though that uh, in next week when I start this job, like seriously doing it more, 
I think I'm probably going to lose like 10 pounds in like two weeks. It's just because uh, I'm going to be in the water. And when you're in the water, you're dealing with so much resistance, even if you're just standing, that you're just going to be burning a lot of calories. Kind of on the same level of progression in terms of building muscle, working out and minding diet got me feeling a lot better too. Yeah, it took me a while to get there. It took me, I think, like three months to get to the point where I feel like I have more energy. Um, when I first started losing weight, I honestly was just getting like groggy and um, I was sleeping in a little bit more, uh, more than normal, or I wanted to sleep in more than normal. And I was also, um, I was feeling a little bit low energy and I just think that's just because my body's like, oh shit, we're getting way less calories now. And then after fidgeting around with my diet, taking out some foods, adding in more foods, um, I kind of got a, a good idea. Uh, I'm getting more at a homeostasis. I guess kind of level um where i do feel now now i feel like i got i do get a little bit more energy there are still some issues i run into like uh sometimes i feel lethargic um specifically when it comes to all this youtube stuff now it's like uh because it's such a huge time sink and half the time i'm just like i could be cooking now and preparing my food for the week um and that's honestly why i'm streaming right now because i'm like okay well i already cooked my pasta I have my French toast, my protein French toast that I usually eat during the week. Uh, uh, I have um, food already prepped to go to lunch for work. So there's not much I need to do right now. So I was like, oh, we should just stream. So once I start working, once I get a reasonable schedule. And uh, hopefully I lose more weight. I think I'll feel a little bit more energy and then I'll probably jump back into doing more kind of youtube related things but for right now that's kind of where i've been at i mean i've been looking at it i, I don't want to half ass it i mean i have been doing other stuff like uh slowly in the background i've been working on my alpha male video but i mean i don't think I'm, that's gonna be done anytime soon i think i'm gonna work on it later today i worked on it earlier this morning at starbucks but we'll see Today, for example, I walked to Starbucks. I could have driven to Starbucks, got in there 10 minutes, got my drink, walked back, uh, driven back 10 minutes, but I decided to walk over there. It took me 40 minutes to walk over there. I drank, got my drink, stayed there for an hour and a half, took my 40 minute walk back. So, you know, doing little things like that. And then hopefully, uh, once I get paid, I'll make a little bit of extra money and then I'll just, uh, I want to use that to buy a few more things. But first, I have to pay off this freaking. Oh, man, I accidentally hit a car. I don't think it, it even is 100% my fault, but uh, I just I also, my insurance company, freaking, um, they changed uh, systems and I think owners and my insurance policy got canceled. So, like, I hit a car and then my insurance company, like, I, I can't find my, they can't find my fucking insurance plan. And I'm just like, ah, uh, shit. This is going to turn into like a $1,000 problem. And it has. Because I have to pay for not having insurance. Now I have to prove that I have insurance by going to court. I have to um, also pay for registration to my car. Which I don't know why that didn't go through. I thought I sent in a check. And uh, I got to pay to fix this guy's car. Which is just a small little dent. But man, dents on cars are so expensive. This just happened literally like last week and i was just like what the fuck the same week i start working i get it like and the way it happened is it's literally at the corner of my house i went to the corner i stopped at the stop sign and i noticed that the house to the right of me had been abandoned i've been living here for three years so this you know i've known some of the people that lived here and like there was just like walls kicked in uh, broken windows like the doors were wide open and i was just like what the fuck happened here and i'm looking to the right i'm in my car and then i put in my reverse and i back up just a little bit now i don't press the gas or anything i just back up just a little bit and all of a sudden this mustang is like to the side of me like uh, uh, like um so if this is if this is my car so let's say stop signs up here this is my car. This is the Mustang that's behind me. Hopefully you can see it. So I back up like this, and I think the Mustang... I, I, I was going to stop, but I, I don't know if either they got scared or maybe that they were... I, I personally think it was an aggressive driver just because I when I stopped at the stop sign, they weren't even behind me. I was at the stop sign for like 
20 seconds, so a little bit normal than what I would normally stop there for. And then they were behind me. I think they just came around the corner because this is a really small sidewalk. I really think they just came around the corner, made a quick turn, and then got behind me. Anyway, so I'm at the stop sign. This is me my car. I back up a little bit to look at this house on the corner that now looks abandoned like this. And then I think what I think happened is that the Mustang driver, they pulled up and went to the right and they hit the edge of their car with the back of my car. And the reason I say that is because the edge of their car got hit. And for them to do that, two things would have happened. Either I would have had to back up at such a weird angle and they would have had to turn their car and uh, towards the sidewalk in this direction. And then the car would have hit like that. Or they would have had to move forward and they would have hit the corner of my car. Either way, the corner of my car got hit and the corner of his car got hit. And I didn't even think about this until afterwards. If I thought about it in the moment, I, I was too, I was like so stressed out. That was already a stressful day. Because <laughs> uh, uh, the whole reason I even went out was to get me and my mom a coffee from McDonald's <laughs> and an apple pie. Ah, man. The, and it's literally McDonald's is right around the corner, too. So uh, this was all happening. I was just like, God damn it. I was like, literally right outside the house. My insurance company fucking changed systems or names or owners or fucking something. They can't figure it out. I can't figure it out. Um, my uh, the, the cop was pissed off at me that I couldn't provide insurance. And then I didn't even know about the registration. I thought the registration was paid for like last July. The fact that registration wasn't paid for, I was just like, oh, well, what the fuck? I was like, registration wasn't paid for? Because the car was in my sister's name, and I we sent in a check when she was in Mexico to the DMV for the registration. I remember it was like $160. I think I saw the receipt for it, so I don't, I don't know. That, those are things I have to argue. But it, it, it was a nightmare. It's like a, it's a logistical bureaucratic nightmare and i don't I, i'm i'm starting to believe though i wasn't 100 percent at fault though uh, uh if i had insurance i think i probably would challenge it but since i don't have insurance you know recent discovery then i'm just not gonna i mean what it would, i don't really have much of a right to to do anything about it but yes it is a nightmare it was a nightmare and i was just like what the fuck I was just like, what the fuck? Yeah, it was very, um, ah, stressful, man. I can't, I can't believe it happened. <sighs> okay, um, all right, this is what we're going to do. Uh, I'm going to make a quick iced coffee. And then I think I'm going to play a DOA. Let me see if I have everything enabled. Yeah, let's. Yeah, let's uh, lower this to like. I think this is good right here. Um, let me go to my settings real quick and change it. Yeah, so, uh, so let me see. Project to support. Yeah, if you ever need uh, tips on, like, muscle progression and stuff or, like, dieting stuff, feel free to ask. I mean, I've been all over it. I'm not I'm not a pro at all, but, I mean, I've, I'm have i getting some results. And then not only that, but, um, but, you know, I'm, we're, we're doing a few things here. I mean, I'm, I'm, uh, I, I did max out my, some of my bench press stuff. Here, let me see if I can get my workout journal. I will say though, if you go to the gym, um, definitely get one of these workout journals. I got the one with the peach on it because you know I'm fabulous like that. And uh, here, I'll show you real quick. You can keep, dude, these things are awesome. I don't know why I never used them before. I feel like such an idiot going to the gym and not using these. <laughs> oh shit, let me see if I have my uh, my filter on. Noise gate and uh, I don't want to deal with the compressor. I don't know what the compressor is yet. Okay, here I'm gonna I'm gonna go up to the camera real quick. Yeah, so with my upper body, you can kind of see right here. 
So my bench press is at 225 twice. And then um, we do that again. And then right here, it's at three times at 230. So once again, uh, bench pressing isn't everything, but it is a good indicator of how strong you are. Um, everyone makes the argument that dumbbell press is better if you're into that. So, uh, because, uh, you get better rotation of the, um, of your chest. The problem with bench pressing is that you're at this angle and th this angle doesn't feel good for everyone. I, for me, if I bench press too much, like I do notice it specifically on my left shoulder and I'm just like, oh, I got to chill out for a second. Huh. <laughs> I like how the, 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 the YouTube's telling me that uh, my audio bit rate isn't good. Okay, let's play a few matches. Oh, let me uh, mute this. Let me, uh... Also, put this these on. I got new in-ear monitors? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, bro. Oh. Oh, yeah. Let's uh, change this, too. Uh, Apex Legends, I uh, will put Dead or Alive. Dead or Alive 6. Whoa, there's a lot of... A Santa Bikini set Marie Rose, what the fuck? Okay, so we're doing Dead or Alive. Right, let me uh monitor this is uh not showing uh it's audio properties monitor and output all right let's mute this to make sure uh Okay, for me, the audio is not working. I have, to, I have to work on that in a bit. Who knows what the problem is. The dumbbell press makes sense. You get better range of motion when doing it properly. Oh, yeah. Huge, huge difference. Dumbbell press is like a big, um, a big, uh, a big thing. All right, cool. So my audio thing is not working. Advanced audio properties, monitor. Oh, oh. Monitor off. I see. I see what I. Do. I see what I do. There we go. Cool. Yeah. So this is DOA. Unfortunately, the the HDR fucks with this game's color. Um. I don't know why. I don't know why this game has an HDR option because it's kind of messes with it. Yeah. But this is uh. As, as, uh, this is, uh, Dead or Alive, basically. Um, the colors are a bit off, because the HDR's on. I don't want to disable it, because I, that might be, I, I mean, I could disable it. Let me see. Because HDR looks great on some games, but with DOA, I don't know why, but HDR looks terrible. All right, let me, let me see if I can disable it real quick. Uh... Video modes. Here we go. Remove HDR. Let's see what happens. Yeah, okay. So we just basically removed uh, HDR. Uh, we should be good. We're going to restart the... Here, let's see what happens if we go back into the game. Yeah, see? Like, that looks better. Let me see. Yeah, that looks way better. <laughs> Wait, why am I lowering the volume like it's a thing? Yeah, so uh, um, this is Dead or Alive. This is a fighting game. Let's go ahead and uh, play some matches. Uh, for anyone that doesn't know, I use uh, Mila. Uh, Mila's pretty cool, so we're going to change our character. 
I love this menu music. This menu music is fantastic. Oh, we could probably unlock these other costumes. Yeah. But uh, no. Yeah, these costumes are uh, easy peasy. It's a game. It's the game with the nice. Yes, it is. Uh, yeah, I forgot. Uh, Mila is considered one of the most unpopular characters in the whole franchise in Japan, uh, which is funny, which makes me think that the reason she got the most fully clothed costumes is because she remains the most unpopular character in Japan. I'm unlocking all her costumes, by the way. Yeah, so because she's the most unpopular character in, in a Japan poll, I, I think this is from like 2018 as well. I think, honestly, that's why she got a lot of fully clothed costumes. Because it is kind of weird. Watch, you'll see what I mean right now. So, this is her regular costume. This is her second costume. Both of these are good. I like them. Uh, also, I've gone on record and just said... I've gone on record before and I say that... Um, uh, I like DOA costumes when they're regular clothes. I think it's awesome because you don't see too many fighting games with regular clothes. I'm not saying that that's I'm not saying that is a bad thing. Yeah, this is her other gym costume, which I do like this one. I actually I like this jacket a lot. I wish I can get this jacket for myself. This is a cool ass jacket. And then uh, my favorite, this is the hobo costume. Um, weird costume, but and then these are just other additional DLC costumes. Kind of everyone has these kind of things. Just like, they, they just kind of go outrageous with the sex appeal. Um, yeah, your Santa bikinis. Uh, Nova sci-fi bodysuit. The maid costumes. The uh, reveal, the alluring Mandarin dress. Oh, the Gus mashup. Which I think there were only three Gus mashup costumes. I can't remember. No, 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 no. I think there, everyone got one. This was a, a, a cust this was this costume is unique because it was a um what's it called when uh this was made by a by a player yeah it was a it's a it's a it's a cool costume and then yeah then these were the this was the last uh, DLC set okay so anyway so those are her costumes um let's look at Ayanis. The, uh, one of the most popular. This is her number one. Cool. Sexy ninja. Got it. Uh, or an OG, a throwback to the OG costume. Um, this is her DOA 5 uh, costume. Um, I don't know what costume this is. I don't know if it's from Ninja Gaiden or something. But it's uh, interesting. Uh, this one's also kind of weird. It's like a casino costume. I don't know if this is also a Ninja Gaiden costume. And then her deluxe costume. And then all these other ones are kind of like just kind of uh, this bonus costume. These are just like swimsuit stuff. Anyway, uh, let's go to Christie's. All right, this is her. I think her DOA three costume. Her because she's a femme fatale. Uh, her dress costume. Her dominatrix costume. <laughs> and uh, I don't know what this is. This is the reverse one. That's kind of, it looks kind of weird. Anyway, my point being is that it's weird that uh, Mila has like, I'm not hating on it. I just think it's, it's funny. I just think it's funny. All right, cool. The hair clip, sure. Sure. Ooh, the cap, I like the cap. All right, we're good. Oh, actually, we want glasses. I do want glasses. I like Rido's glasses because they look so dorky. Hell yeah. You know, the anime kind of glass? That's the best one. Oh, I forget that. You have to press... Um, yeah. It, when you're in the rank uh, menu, it, it changes a little bit. Yeah, and that's, uh, that's the OA6 in a nutshell. DOA 6, it's not bad. It's one of my favorite fighting games. I love the uh, the, the system it has. Um, but um, it's a uh, <coughs> it's 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 
it's not everyone's favorite game, and it's not everyone's favorite game for a reason. Because um, uh, one, sex appeal. Some people say it's out of control. Some people say it doesn't have enough. Um, the other issue with the game is that compared to other fighting games, uh, this one's popularity has really waned. I think at its heyday, I think DOA 2 or DOA 3 were its most popular entries. Um, DOA 4 was a really popular one, but that was a uh, Xbox uh, specific uh, DOA. And then uh, when DOA 5 I f launched, I feel like that's when the uh, it started going sort of... I mean, you can make the argument that DOA 4 launching on the Xbox was like a death sentence. But I mean, it did so well. It had Microsoft money. Oh, hell yeah. Okay, I'm a hold heavy character. I'm a hold heavy... Oh my gosh. Oh boy, there is some lag. Oh, there is... There is some noticeable lag. Oh, Jesus. Not like this. Grab, grab. Okay, cool. We took her arm. We take those. Uh, what? Alright, we take her arm. What? Okay, the fact that I'm not catching those is kind of weird. Alright. Alright, I can't believe I'm doing these many reads. All right, normally, we don't do these many kind of... What? Ay, 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 ay. Unfair. Some I want to judge. I want to judge. Oh, that was a high. Those are high attacks. So when you do these counters uh, attacks that you see me doing, you can only do them if if you do the cor it. Oh my gosh. You can only do them if you do the correct counter for the right um, arm or leg attack. So it's a, while you see me doing them a, a lot, it's a very specific, uh, it's a very specific command. Yeah. So I have to predict that she's going to do a high punch right there or a high attack for that to work. So if I do a, a, a hold for a low attack or middle attack, it's not going to work. Oh my gosh. Oh boy, this is this is so slow. This Okay. Let's go. Alright, she's gonna go for a low attack. No! There we go. She did the high attack and then I went with a mid counter. Look at that. Look at that. If FaZe ever starts a fighting game division, I'ma be in it. Uh, I will say, compared to other DOA fighters, I have a very uh, hold heavy. I don't want to say counter heavy because you can counter every attack has like three, like three different counters. But I I do have a very hold heavy uh, playstyle that you don't really see too much. All right. Oh no! She got me. She twisted my neck. She played me like a fiddle. Oh. Oh. Ooh, high counter. She does these high uh Oh. Oh. Ooh, okay. All right. Uh, I think she's going to Why did why did uh No! Why? Why? Why would the game do this to me? Why, in my hour of victory, would the game decide to crash? Uh, I don't know if they quit. Uh, uh, they could have. Um, most most people that play this game, they don't run into like a high hold uh, player. A uh, high hold. It's not a high hold. A hold heavy uh, player like me. That is a very somewhat unique playstyle. I guess I bring to the table. But this is bullshit. Thomas has never seen such bullshit. Well, let me see if my uh, gain is low. Yeah, okay. Okay, let me uh, back the mic up. Alright, let's try restarting the... Oh, oh! Your opponent has disconnected from the network! Oh! 
We made him rage quit. We made him rage quit. Hell yeah. Look at that. Once again, my playstyle is unusual and very rare. You don't see people having my kind of playstyle. You don't see it because doing holds in this game is extremely. Um, uh, sorry, Griever. I know I'm talking like you don't play DOE. But, but for reals, doing holds in this game is um, is absolutely, um, it, it, it is a very risky, very, very risky, um, uh, where is it? Yeah, well, anyway, it's a, it's a very risky uh, move to do. Because for me to do a hold on her high punch... She has to, I ha, she has to do a high punch, and I have to anticipate at the correct time to do a high hold. Hold up, I'm gonna take off. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk while it's loading. Okay, so in DOA you have high attacks, mid attacks, and low attacks. For you to do a hold, you have to anticipate that they're gonna do a high attack, or a low attack, or a mid attack. But mid attacks are unique because for mid attacks. They either have to do a mid punch or a mid kick. And which, oh, we're not going to play against this guy. And whichever one that is, there is a different hold for a mid punch and a mid kick. So uh, the way I have the, so to do a hold, you have to press guard and back. It's basically a parry. And so you either do a high parry or a low parry. And then if you want to do a mid parry, a mid hold, you basically have to predict that they're either going to do a mid punch or a mid kick. You can say, um, now, you can say, oh, well, if you know the character's combos, then you should be able to know that. But one of the things that makes this game very different is, um, I don't know if in fighting games you've heard the term 50-50. Uh, let me know if you have or not. When a, If a move is 50-50. 50-50 means that basically it can be, so like in a 2D fighting game, uh, usually you have to choose between uh, kicks and punches. A 50-50 attack could be a combo that ends in a kick or a punch. And you basically have to guess what that is so you can block for it accordingly. In this game, almost every combo and sequence of, of combo strings are potential 50-50s. So you're constantly trying to guess what your opponent's going to do. Yeah, Alright. Oh. Alright, they're, they're, they're not here. Okay, I'm going to move this down here. I'm going to make myself smaller as well. That way you guys can see a little bit better. Alright, cool. So, Marie Rose, she's a, she's considered a very, like, punish-heavy character. And, uh, uh, I mean, what that, what that means is basically for... You really need to punish your opponent if you're playing Marie Rose. Like, you need to be able to predict what your opponent's going to do. Not all characters are like that. Some of them are combo heavy. Some of them are throw heavy. But Marie Rose is is a punish heavy character. So for you to capitalize with Marie Rose, uh, you need to basically predict what your opponent's gonna do. That mean for some people, some people see that as a disability. Some people see that as a challenge. Um, you know, for me, it's not that hard to play against her. See, because a lot of her a lot of her combo starters start very similar. Yeah. So. So I'm gonna go over uh, after this match. I'll I'll mention something about 50 50s. Yeah. Oh oh, I missed that. Oh, she got me. I did a I did a hold. But once again, I I I. Ooh. Okay okay. I don't know where she's going. Yeah. So Marie Rose usually punish heavy characters like Mar oh I mean a lot of characters. A lot of characters in this game have 50-50s. I would say uh, uh, Marie Rose has more 50-50s than normal. Than the average, than the, the, I would say the average cast. Oh shoot, this might be it. This might be it, boys. We have... Alright, we're gonna do a jumping punch. This is a risky move. Oh, she got me. Woo! With the punch. Alright. Ooh, ooh, style. Okay, that was a mid punch and a higher punch. Okay, that's a mid kick. Ooh, with the mid kick again. Alright, let's see if we can predict that again. Mid kick? Oh, she did low kick. So that's one thing to keep track of. So when I caught her mid kick, she did a low kick. 
So, right here. And then if she wakes up again, if she survives, no. Yeah. I used to play King of Fighters, Street Fighter. I'm, I'm looking into Guilty. Dude, I want to play Guilty Gear so bad, but Guilty Gear is only on PlayStation. It's such bullshit. Thomas has never seen such bullshit before. Guilty Gear should not be locked. A, a game that cool should not be locked to, to Sony's tyrannical demands. I cannot believe that Guilty Gear is not on other systems. Ah, oh, I really wish I could get a PS5, man. Oh, ooh, ooh, that's a good grab right there. That's a, that's a very, that's, okay. See, so right there, she did two high attacks, a low attack, and then another high attack. Oh, with the low kick. Oh, three low kicks. Oh, she did a low grab. All right, we're going to grab. All right, she's starting to block a lot now, so I'm going to switch my playstyle to, to a grabbing kind of playstyle. Alright, so she's grabbing a lot, so... Right. I, mean, I mean, she's blocking a lot. Oh. 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 Oh, these mix-ups. She, she, she's baiting me. Oh, she got me. Dude, she, she's just throwing me. She's doing all these mix-ups. I, I can't tell. It's hard for me to tell where she's going to go. So, she's pl he's playing to Marie's Rosa's strengths. Right, Marie Rose also has a lot of stances. Oh yeah, yeah. You, I, but I don't want to play it on, on PC. I, I don't like. I, I don't like playing games on PC. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Got her. Mid. Oh, look at that. Look at that read. That prediction. All right, we're grabbing. Remember, we're grabbing a lot. I I say remember like you're playing, but re you got to remind me to grab. All right. Ooh. All right, those are. Whoa. Oh wow, dude! That, uh, right there, both of us did not know what was going on. Okay. Uh, dude, I want to go for a grab, but I'm very nervous to approach her. Oh, what? Yo, she got me. Can't even be mad. You can't even be mad. Yes, they do. There. Hey, what's up, Gravy? How, how's your day going, Gravy? Uh, my day's pretty good. I, w I walked to Starbucks and I made pasta. I was talking about weight loss stuff at the ver first half of the stream. And then uh, now I'm just playing uh, DOA. Get over here. Ooh. That. All right, cool. We got her. Oh, my gosh. D these these reads. I'm reading more than a librarian right now. Oh, my gosh. That was so good. That was so good. Yeah, so basically, once again, uh, uh, Griever, yeah, this game is all about raids and punishes. Just like any fighting game, except I would say this game focuses way more on them. Oh, with the suplex! Oh! That was crazy! Ah, oh, man. Oh, dude, she did not know what was about to happen right there. Dude, she's so discombobulated. She saw, she, okay, see, she's going back to her high attack play style. Oh. Oh my gosh. She's trying to juggle me. Oh. Oh no, I fucked up. Oh, that didn't kill me. Get over, oh. Ah, uh, dude, she she saw me trying to grab her. <laughs> no, nah, what's wrong with glasses? Uh, Gra Gravelon, does that mean you hate Bayonetta? Everyone in Bayonetta has glasses. Ooh, yo, she's making the comeback. She's she's making me. Okay, cool. All right, that was a fake out. We did a cancel of our attack animation. All right, she's gonna do a low. <sighs> no. 
Okay, so she's doing high. Okay, mid, mid. That, that's a mid and a... Okay. Oh, no. Dude, I, I, I have... <laughs> I have, I have lost the lead. Alright. Cool. Alright, we're just gonna, we're gonna be cheap. I should have done a, a mid kick. Oh, what? That was a mid kick counter. I did it. Ooh. Ooh, I'm fucking up. I'm fucking up. Oh. Okay. Oh. Get what? Got her. Let's go. <laughs> oh. Woo. Bayo is low tier bait like vampire lane. Uh, if I were this guy, I would be absolutely pissed. Because once again, uh, Griever, most people say, most people see, like, landing a hold as luck. So, like, if you're constantly doing them, most people will be like, oh, you're bad, you're bad, you're bad. It's, 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 um, you know, I love doing holds, man. My favorite thing, the hype of doing a hold and, like, reversing an attack, it's, it's too much, man. Just, I'm, I'm injecting that into my veins every single night. It's my favorite thing about this game. Yeah, I wish I, I totally wish the game would be more popular. I will say though that ever since they re-released all the other uh, DOA one, two, three, and four on Xbox, once they like got their uh, backwards compatibility patch, um, since then uh, I would say this game's definitely been way more popular. But apparently, the one on PC is the one that has the least amount of lag input, but. I mean, hey, man, if you've been playing on console your whole the, your whole life, you know, wh what's a lag input? You don't even know what that is. You don't even know what the word lag means. Uh, I don't know. Sure, we'll try. Dun, dun. Oh, phase four. Oh, and they're a uh, ruby rank. Oh man, this is gonna be hard. Uh, this character is very difficult for me to read. Oh uh, yeah, I, I I don't know what I'm doing here. Uh, he's got an eleven win streak. Uh, let's see if we can ruin his win streak at least. What? Oh. Oh, he he got it. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, what a what a simple tactic that worked. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Just start with the ultimate. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see if we can ruin his win streak. I don't think I can beat him in terms of skill, but I think I can I think I can at least like make him angry. Ooh, see that's such a combo heavy attack. That's such a that's crazy. With the with the low kick, with the jab for confusion. Ooh, I, I can't tell where he's gonna go. Oh, what the punish grab? Yeah. Oh. Let's go. Oh, dude, this guy—he—he he may be strong in the combos, but while he was studying the combos, I was—I was studying how to do grabs. Oh. Dude, this character absolutely is a ninja. She's very, she's very, like, like, I can't even get a chance to do my combo. Ooh, she had me locked in that corner. I didn't know what to do. Ooh. 
Yeah, I can't I can't tell where she's gonna go. Oh shit, I, I can't tell. Ooh. Alright, we need to we need to do this. Yeah. I, I don't like doing that, but we're gonna have to. Okay. Hmm. I, I can't tell their pattern. It's too, uh, I'm too stupid. All right. We might do this. I like this. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, what is he doing? He's juggling me. Ah, he's grabbing me now. I can't tell. I can't tell where he's going to go. Whoa! <laughs> Dude, that was... That was good on him. I didn't know what to do. Yeah, he was just uh, tossing me around like uh, I was a bag of popcorn in the microwave. Just... Yeah, the character absolutely is a ninja. Uh, very difficult to understand where, what they're going to do. Oh boy. Ooh. Whoa. <sighs> There's definitely Oh my gosh, is that is that GG's? Yeah, dude. Ah, dude. When she goes in the air and she just starts like uh, using me as a beanbag, I, I I don't know what to do. Okay. Oh, oh, not again. There we go. Oh my gosh, I haven't been able to land a single hold this whole match, I think. That's how I'm pretty, uh, normally, but hey man, maybe this is how they got their ruby rank. Alright, we got something, we got one there. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Cool. Oh no! Why? What? Why? How dare she force me to lose? We weren't able to get rid of her win streak either. She has a thirteen match win streak now. We just helped her. We just contributed to the number going higher. Um, let's see. Yeah, I don't, I'm trying to think about what I could have done differently in that match. Uh, but yeah, I, she, she was, she definitely is a ninja. She, she, she totally could be a character in Demon Slayer. Absolutely. Okay. Um, Okay, let's go. Let's see. <clears throat> Alright, let's see. But yeah, what you think of uh, DOA so far, uh, Griever? Is, is this your kind of game? Uh, that's probably her again. I do not want to run into that ninja again. It's too difficult. Too difficult. The amount of bullshit I have to tolerate when I'm playing against a, a disappearing and reappearing ninja is too high.
Um, I'm kind of, sorry, guys. I'm kind of scrolling through Twitter right now. Uh, medium disconnect. Okay, let's let's get in it. Talking about Demon Slayer, have you watched the last season? Of, no, I've not actually watched Demon Slayer. I keep thinking, I don't know why, but I keep thinking Demon Slayer is like high school DXD, where it's just a fan servicey ass anime with some action here and there. I have been rewatching though uh, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. I think I'm on episode 24. I haven't seen that show in such a long time. It feels like I'm watching it again for the first time. Don't like neutral heavy games. Oh, yeah, I guess this is too, this is a neutral heavy game. Yeah, you know, that's a that's a good way of putting it. I I did not think about that. He's like, nah, I just like it when I start the combo and I keep going to combo. But anything beyond the combo, nah, -uh, brother. Keep that shit out of my game. <laughs> Oh, he disconnected. I hope that gives me the, the win. Um, I'd rather the rounds be resolved quicker. Oh, really? Hmm. I've won games where I've let the, cl where the clock run out. <laughs> okay, uh, sure. Uh, this person is a wired connection, so that's uh, A-OK -okay with me. No problema, man. <laughs> okay, uh... Yeah, but uh, DOA, man, I love it. I love this character I'm using, Mila. It's probably the character I'm best with. I can also use a character, Lei Fang. I'll try using her, her next. That's basically why plates so much. It, if you look it up, the combos go so crazy. See, I hate that. I hate remembering a combo, man. That that stresses me out. Oh, this is an A minus rank, and this is Hayate. This is a character I don't play against very often. They got a seven win streak as well. So we'll see. We'll see. Let's see. Yep, we might be able to win just doing this. All right, so those are two high attacks. I'm trying to figure out where, where he's going to go. Yep. All right, we're going to follow him up. Oh, he didn't do a wake-up kick. That's that's interesting. Got him. Look at that. First round is usually more neutral base, but second and third round go a lot faster. Yep, yeah, in KOF, don't you also have like parties of three? Or parties of two or three? I think the only KOA I have is like KOA Kino Fighters 13, the sprite one, which has really cool sprites, but I, I didn't play it nearly enough to kind of. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Dude, he was he was good right there. Okay, so we both did the same thing of high punch and low kick right there. But his was better. All right, cool. All right. So after he does that flying kick, I think he goes into a, a like a like um what's that position where you're a crouching position? There we go. Ooh, dude, he did. I don't know why he didn't do. Dude, that's a one pixel win. Okay. All right, I'm gonna be going with fates now. I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a fake out. Watch. Oh, I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. Ooh. Ooh! Look at that fake out. Oh, that's not what was supposed to happen right there. Uh, I absolutely I hate grinding combos, dude. Me and you are totally opposite. I fucking hate grinding combos. <laughs> grinding combos is such a pain in the butt. I 
I think I tried doing the combo challenge for like Mila, this character I'm using, and then I think on the last one I was like, you know what, fuck this. That's see, that's why I, I do a counter heavy playstyle. Cause fuck these combos. Oh! Oh no. Oh. Ooh, he saw that. Oh, I can, okay, so I can't. Oh my sweet lord baby Jesus. Yeah, matches are fought by a team of three, so you get to mix up and play different characters with alternative playstyles. Makes it a lot more dynamic. I kind of scared all my brothers and nephews from playing games with me because of that. Yeah, too too good to play with family, not good enough to play at tournaments. I get you. Yeah, uh, that's what I hear from everyone. But that's the only King of Fighters I played, and I didn't. I think I only played like maybe two hours of it, so not enough to remember anyone's names. In fact, I think the only King of Fighters character in this game is Mila. No, not Mila. Uh, Mai and Kula. Yeah, Mai and Kula are in this game. I don't know if you know that. Yeah. So if you want me to, to not choose them, but like so you can see them real quick, let me know. Because they do have like full 3D renders. Oh my gosh. Oh, he got me with this one now. Ooh. And go stay down. Oh, sweet little baby Jesus. Oh, I should not have taunted. I didn't mean to taunt. Now he's going to go. Ah, dude, the players get so salty when you taunt. Okay. I, ha I have a hard time knowing when. Okay. Oh, that's not a low kick. That's a mid kick. Interesting. Oh my gosh. Yeah, this guy's the mix-up king. I got no idea where he's going to go. Oh. Yeah, he uh, he knew where he was going. This costume is pretty sick, though. Oh, look at my, my, my dumb ass. All right, I don't think I don't know if he, I don't think he wanted a rematch. All right, so here, watch. Um, yeah, so this is uh, my right here. Uh, no. Yeah. Yeah, she's got this costume. I think she's got a pirate costume. Uh, uh her nurse costume, uh, her maid costume. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you just move the triggers, you could uh, activate the jiggle physics in the menu, which is funny. Yeah. Uh, and then the sexy bunny costume, which is, I think this is the costume I see the mind most. The really cool thing about this sexy bunny costume, though, is that, well, actually, one thing that I like a lot about her costumes is that if you look at the back of them, they integrated, like, her, her big-ass bow that she has on the back of her regular costume. So each one of these costumes from the wedding costume to the uh the pirates costume uh the the nurse and and all of them they all have that big bow in the back which is actually like it's cool attention to detail yeah and uh i'm pretty sure she has her own glasses somewhere hairstyle so she's got yeah she just has the one hairstyle but yep that's my and then there's also kula Kula is a little similar to Marie Rose, except she doesn't have as many holds. She's a very punish heavy character. Very, very, like, her, she's a damage, most of her damage is done by punishing whatever you're doing. So whether it's a throw, a hold, or a punch, her, her stuff is done by, um, by, uh, punishing. Yeah, so she's got a wedding costume for the, the weebs that think that they can get her, her pirate costume i do think her pirate costume is honestly one of the cutest ones yeah oh i think she's also one of the characters that has the longest amount of hair like her hair physics kind of get weird yeah she's a she's a she's a ninja for sure yeah this is her nurse outfit the maid 
the 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 sexy bunny. I think that's it. Yeah. Yeah, but those those are the two uh, King of Fighter characters. Wait, does does she have a gust? Okay, yeah, I guess yeah. There we go. Everyone does have a gust mashup costume then. That's cool for everyone that wants that. Mm. Design 2019. That was the contest. Oh yeah, she has the uh, taller Riza costume and the uh, the the gust. Yeah. Okay. So the gusting was the thing for everybody. Yeah, but there's my uh, and uh, Kula. They are DLC characters, so you won't see them too often. But they're uh, my she she's got she's combo heavy. She can do some throws. Kula is very punish heavy. Yeah, yeah, she's very her punish damage. Like whether when I say punish, I mean like you know they do the correct counter to whatever you're doing, whether it's a punch or whatever. Um, yeah, her punish damage is insane. Like it's 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 crazy. Like it's it's a she she she's small, she's a small bean, but she's a powerful bean. Powerful but small. Uh, no, we're not matching with that. We're gonna wait. All right, let's uh, try this again. <laughs> um oh dude we're we're just not getting we're not getting good people oh yeah let me try playing with lei fang for a little bit that way we get like some different action so lei fang is also a hold heavy character um she's a little bit like uh what's her name in um in uh tekken Zhao ling or something like that Oh yeah, this is her like revealing costume. We'll play with a revealing costume, sure. Also, I don't know if you know this, but uh, I'm assuming you don't because you don't play. But if you choose, so normally you confirm a costume with with A, right? But if you confirm it with with any other button, you hear that sound effect. That means you're changing the 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 style of the panties. <laughs> Isn't that funny? So there's style one, style two. Yeah, and style three. I I don't know what they I'm we're not gonna Yeah, we're not gonna There we go. Yeah, so every every female character you can do that with, which is kind of I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> I think younger me would have liked it. Older me is just like, that's a weird feature. But hey, to each their own. Apparently, you could also do that in other DOA games, so... Who cares? Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, for real, so you could do that. It's kind of weird. Here, watch. I'll show you what I mean. So we'll, we'll, we'll I'll, I'll show you what I mean. Yeah, it's a uh, once again, DOA is a very like sexualized game. Uh, I think people forget that. Some people, once again, some people though, they see that as a good thing. Other people see that as a bad thing. So it's kind of, I think I used to be a little bit more judgmental about it. Uh, now I don't really care as much just because, you know, some people, some people, they like it. Some people, they, they don't care. 
Yeah, so if we go to versus. Let's see, minimum, four way, calm level. We're gonna put nine. We're gonna put the most difficult. Yeah, so if we do. Here, we'll just. We'll, I'm just using this as an example. So if I choose her with A. Sure. And then we'll choose. I'm trying to see. Sure, this one. Hanukkah. Yeah, so. We're doing research right now. If anybody comes in during this this part of the stream, this is a re this has turned into a research stream, okay? I don't want anyone getting upset. If anyone comes in through my door, this is this is for research. Oh, oh yeah, I, I can't. What the hell was her combo? I can't remember her combo. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh. Oh. Oh boy. Uh, I don't know how that worked out. And she dead. Alright, cool. And then we'll... Uh, or something. Um. Oh yeah, you could also move the camera here, which is how you can actually check if you want. <laughs> Um, but, uh, hold up. Okay. Alright, so then we're going to change character. And then we'll do the same thing. So we'll switch. We'll switch. We'll, 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 we'll choose with the other thing. Yeah, so we, we chose with R2. We chose with R2. So, once again. Research. 100% research. We'll do random. Oh boy. I'm getting some lag right now. I don't know why. Oh, this, this, this stage is lagging. Ooh. Oh my sweet rubber baby Jesus. Hey. Does it really hurt that much? Yeah, so uh Cool. Alright, let's quit. So watch. This is what I mean. This is a, not uh griever. You are about to you're about to see the fruits of our research. So we're going to go to theater, fight viewer. Yeah. So we have two. Remember, we chose one with A. This is the first one. The second one we chose with R2. So what does what does that amount to? You're about to see. This is what this is what everyone in this room came for. So if we look over here, see, just black, there's like a little flowery design thing. All right. And if we look at Hanukkahs, they're like white and have a little bow and a little pink, right? Right? So once again, there's like, they're like black and have like, yeah, there you go. They have like a little flowery design, right? All right, so knowing this information, we can go back to select replay. Because once again, we are researching. We we take things serious on the Romero channel. And the second match, this is the one that we, we, we click with R2. So this is the, the R2 selection. 
This is, uh... Alright. Uh, yeah, now this is the real replay system. See? So now, no more flowers. Now they're lacy. Yeah, they're laced. Yeah, see? Yeah, see? So now, no more flowers. They're just completely laced up. For the most part, yeah. And then if we look at Hanukkah's, hers are no longer white. They got like a weird star pattern on them. And they have like a... Uh, uh, they, they have a pink... Uh, yeah, they have a pink outline. See? Yeah, yeah. Actually, this is a good frame to get both of them. Yeah, see? <laughs> oh, that's fucking funny. This is so fucking funny, dude. I, I find this hysterical. Yep. I will say though, this is this replay system is unironically actually really good for making thumbnails. Because you can just remove the HUD and just kinda get what you need. This yeah, so this I've used the when I used to make DOA videos, I would use the replay system a lot to uh actually just like get cool images or thumbnails and stuff. But yeah, that is That's one of those features that I don't think the general public knows about the gen pop there's no way i can get you a uh, kula or mice uh panties though because that's a uh... mind if i share yeah go for it i don't care i mean you're not a you're not a weird person yeah so for anyone that's just coming into the stream we were just doing research that was it only research no nothing too crazy I was highlighting hidden features of the DOA game. Uh, yeah, so what's the link for? It's a pretty handy mode. <laughs> There's there's a joke in there somewhere. <laughs> no, the the replay system in this game is unironically very good because you can you can't rewind. That's the only bad thing. But you can pause. You can change angles. It's good for photography. It's good for thumbnails. I mean, it's very. They were definitely forward thinking with it. It's good for analyzing your fights, and it's um. It's it's not good for perverts. <laughs> it's not good for perverts. Kid came out something like that too. So many memes came of it. Oh yeah, dude, the the one with uh, Sora just doing a smile, and then they pretty much just remove the background and put whatever he wants. <laughs> That's a great one. Okay, okay, I'll check it out. Let me see what this clip is. We'll react to it. I like reacting to things. Alright, I just followed Fleshlight on Twitter. I hope I don't regret that. I get really nervous about following a night safe for work. I think the game froze. I get really nervous about following not safe for work. Oh, shit. Not safe for work um, accounts on Twitter. Because you never know when they're going to post. Like, earlier today, I was at a Starbucks. And, like, I follow some cosplayers. And, like... The their cosplay came up and I was like, oh, gotta scroll through this really fast on my laptop. Can do not want to show this. It makes me not want to use Twitter at a at a on a computer, but I mean, that's how my preferred way of using Twitter. Right, come on game start working i think the game's servers crashed or something 
Uh, oh, let me see if the... Uh, I just realized. I don't know if it's going to show. Create a poll. There's a way. Top chat. Yeah, here we go. Live chat. Uh, did you post a clip? Because uh, I don't see it. Yeah, I don't know if um, if uh, YouTube removed it. I don't think they did. Normally when they remove it, it tells you that they removed it. So. Mm, okay. All right, let's let's see. Let's find a match. Let's find a match. Let's find a match. Somewhere out there there is a match. Okay, uh it didn't show, so let me I, I okay, this I just need to make you a mod, I think. Okay, try posting it again. I just made you a mod for the channel. So usually mods can post leaks. Uh, so. Here, let me, uh, let me see. I will check for you. Uh, uh, let me also check something because, um, participants, all right, let me go to my YouTube settings real quick because on YouTube it will also, um, I can, uh, if I go to my settings on YouTube, I can uh, make certain um, a value as a value. Oh, yeah, all uh, permissions. Yeah, I see it now. It's there. All right, so let's see what this is. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, wow. Hey, man, the clips feature, it works. That's fucking funny. Here, let me show you how this looks, so you can see. This looks pretty cool. Uh, yeah. So, no, uh, this is pretty cool because um, you don't, we don't, we, I, the YouTube clips thing is kind of so so weird. It's very weird right now, but this this is perfect. This is so funny. God, my hair, you know, that's so fucking funny. That's so fucking funny. <laughs> uh, I'm going to copy this and I'm going to post it on the community uh, thing of my YouTube channel. God, that's the one thing that sucks. I wish um, YouTube would organize, uh, would organize. Okay, let me see. 
Oh, the video is not found. Of course it's not found. But this will be permanent for the most part. Yeah, right here. So we're going to post it. Yeah, so if anyone comes across... Oh, wow, this is seven months ago. Dude, I... See, from here to now, I've totally lost weight. Yeah, see, so that's... Dude, yeah, see, so you can totally tell right there. The clips, they stay public. Like, I have access to them, but I think YouTube is going to roll out something probably in the next year or two where it will document them. So, yeah, they're public to anyone that has the link. <laughs> it's so dumb. Yeah, so this is actually, you can kind of see, so check this out. So, this is what I used to look like for the most part. This is kind of, let me try and recreate the pose. Yeah, see, so way smaller. Actually, let me uh put in my pants just to. Yeah, so old me. Yeah, that was probably when I was at my biggest. You me? Yeah, see, like way smaller. Way smaller. Except for my shitty back. <laughs> All right, hold up. I need to go. I need to pee. I'll be back. Oh, you know what? I could turn that clip. If you get to to the live through the clips, you get to stay. If you get a dope one, it's nice to post on social media mid live stream. Yeah. Um, I I there I don't know what YouTube's doing exactly with the way they do like their clips. For example, um, here, cause uh, let me see. Let me uh here. So I'll show you some of this the back end YouTube stuff. I don't, I don't think I'm showing you anything like too crazy. Yeah. Uh, here. I'll I will, I'll post it on Twitter for sure. Yeah, so it says right here. So if you go to Twitter, actually, you know, you're seeing me on the live stream, right? Yeah. So it says right there, uh, Cotton 4K, 26 seconds, clip by Griever. If we click on it, I think it, I don't know if it's, let me see what it plays. So it plays a 26 second video. If we go to watch on YouTube, see, it has a little scissors emoji. So this is like a really unique kind of, um, video landing page it's technically the live stream page but it just it, it like it's a very specific cutout if i go over here to my channel see i wish up here there would be like a section that says like your clips or something anyway so how, how can i tell what my clips are i gotta go over here yeah so these are clips that i that i have made from a long time ago but yeah, I can't see like clips that people have made of me for the most part. Let's see if I go to um oh, This is everything I was watching. <laughs> oh, let's watch this. It's Morbin time. This is so funny. Time to die. 
Let's try this again. That's so funny. That's what I was watching earlier. That that that's where my brain is at. Okay, um Yeah, so the the other thing I don't like is that I kind of wish like let's say I got here like I don't know, the way YouTube does links is weird. It's cuz like they want it to be it tells it tells you who made it. It it tells you how many views it has when it was made. Uh, that you can share it, but if you go to the live stream, like, it's not here. And if you go to the video after the live stream's over, it's still not, not going to be there. So what I did is I posted it over here in the community section of my channel. Yeah, see? I put it, I put it right here. So people might see it as a post when they're scrolling on YouTube. Um, that being said, uh... Yeah, that's the only way I can sort of see it. I w Once again, YouTube is doing something in the future. Let me go to the studio. I don't know exactly what it is that they're uh, doing. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, so let me see if there's... If I go to content. I don't think I have anything here that's, uh, that's uh, private for the most part. And also, I can't add the clips to a playlist. That's the other problem, is that I can't... I can't add the, the, the clips to a, to a playlist. So, I don't... You know, that's, that's a bummer as well. But yeah, let me see. I'm trying to see. Yeah, no, that's... Yeah, so once again, it's a, it is permanent. It's, it's permanent, but I just... Don't have access to it myself. You have access to it, but when you go to your uh, area. So, like, once again, if you go to your YouTube channel on PC, I guess. I don't know how it is on mobile, but on PC, it will be up here on the left. It will just say your clips. But that's kind of... That's kind of it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Let's go back to full. See what you're saying. It seems to loop sp uh, the specific part of the live stream that was clipped, and then you can click a little live ball so you get to update to the current moment. Yep. Yeah. So it's a. Uh, I don't know. I mean, it's. I don't know what. I know YouTube's doing something else with it because. Uh, hopefully, YouTube, if you're watching, you know. I get emails from YouTube that take that where I take some surveys on some upcoming features that they're working on for live streams or videos. So I know they're working on something to do with the clips. I just don't know what it is. Yeah. I just don't know what it is. Yeah, so if you go to your homepage on the YouTube landing page, on the left bar, there should be like your clips section. And I guess that's where they're going to be held, but it, it'd be cool if that was on, like, my YouTube. Like, if on my YouTube page, it was show everyone, the clips everyone's made on my YouTube channel, like it does on Twitch. Yeah, see, it shows up on your library, but it won't show up on mine. So it's you have access to it. And I posted it on my community, so you know, people will be able to see it from Twitter or whatever, but it's it is, you know, annoying. Yeah, so I don't I don't know. Once again, I know YouTube's doing something for it. I have no idea what. They just actually secretly integrated um um hosting sort of uh, like when your live stream's over but uh i don't know how well it works i don't have any like friends that that um 
stream on uh, YouTube. What? Oh my gosh. Whoa! Oh, I didn't realize that today. Yeah, see, so I mean, I don't, I don't know, man. It's YouTube's, YouTube's weird. Ooh. Yeah. So okay. So sorry, Lei Fang. She's a very counter heavy, not counter heavy, hold heavy character. So she spe she relies on doing specific folds. Like she she her thing is kind of she like minimizes some cold and then she's got some I think they're called Subakas where it's like a parry attack. So like this right here, if I were to do that on one of his punches, then uh he would uh it would parry. Like my attack would go through and stop his attack. The same thing with this attack. Let me see. So if I press back back punch, let me see. Yeah. I'm trying Uh, it just uh, it doesn't work on all attacks. It, like an attack has to have a certain property. But yeah, Leifang's really dope. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, right there. That was a parry attack. I stopped his attack and then went forward with mine. Yep. Once again, Lei Fang, super awesome character. She's a parry kind of character. Um, she simplifies using holds for the most part. Because you have you have this hold, which is this this hold right here, is like uh, it can block any mid attack. So, oh. <laughs> Dude, I don't care. <laughs> You're fine. Hey, those kind of—I I like those kind of jokes. I think they're really funny. You're good. And then this is uh. Oh. Oh, she got me right there. Yeah, I just wish uh, YouTube would do better clip integration. Oh boy. Ooh. Ooh. Shit. Shit. Oh no, no, no. Ooh. Damn. Okay, this is hard. Let's see. Ooh. I'm, I'm trying to remember how to play here. Oh, that's a combo right there. That is the like her main combo. Ooh. 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 All right. Oh no. What? Ah, <laughs> uh, too good. Yeah, that's a. Uh, I mean, that's kind of what I get though for like. So this man fights the drunken fist out. Yep. Very hard to read because his attacks are. The animation of them are just all over the place. But he's basically a combo character. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, like his attacks. It, they're very hard to read because his animations are kind of like yeah look at how much damage that did just that was just a that's crazy i got trauma with that my brother used to kick my ass with drunken fist characters attacking three yeah dude it's 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 very uh it is trauma inducing for sure it's just the animations completely throw you off man it's like you're you're not 100 too sure 
what you should do. Yeah. Dude, he, that was perfect on his part. Alright. Okay. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out what's what. Okay, so that's a high attack. That's a, That's gotta be a mid. That... Okay, that's his specials are mid. Most specials are high attacks, so that's kind of weird. Oh, what? I don't know what happened there. Okay, I think I'm going to do one more match and then I'm going to make myself a nice coffee. <laughs> But yeah, Griever, that's that's pretty much DOA. It's got like you know, it's just a fighting game. It's a little bit pervy, but it's it's a very fun, neutral heavy kind of a guessing game. It's a lot of fun. I wish more people would play it, but hey, man, can't get everything right. Yeah, I, I would like to make more videos for DOA, but when I was making videos for DOA, there was like some of the best videos I think I've made, and they got like no views, which is kind of a bummer. That was like such a, that was, ah, oh, man, that was, ooh, that was like a little demoralizing, honestly. Because you get videos that, you know, they're they're not bad. I'm, I want, they're not, I say that. Usually if I can laugh at my own video, I think it's okay. Okay, so we're playing this guy again. Okay. Okay, that should have been a high attack. Yeah, I'm uh, after this match I'm going to get make myself some coffee. Oh boy. Oh, dude, look at that. Look at this drunk man. This man, he drank himself some vodka and then was like, all right, let me style on, let me flex on this man. Let me style on him. Oh, no. Oh. Oh. Oh, he's dead. Yep, got it. Okay, okay. So I think I can confuse him too. With my grabs. I don't think he knows how to deal with my grabs. Ooh. Okay, yeah, so she does have that triple kick. Okay, I'm remembering. Oh boy. Oh, I sure grabbed him. Oh my gosh. No. Oh, shoot. Oh, man. This is so stressful. Come on, Brad Wong. Oh. Okay, that's not the counter. Oh boy. Oh. I'm slowly remembering things and then I'm slowly forgetting them. He's got no bottle. <laughs> he was just drinking with no bottle. This man's just drinking air and kicking my ass. Oh, I wasn't sure where to go with there. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, that's her one of her advance holds. Okay. Oh man, I just don't know what to do.
Oh, sweet Lord, baby Jesus. Okay. Nope. Whoa. Mid kick, mid kick, mid kick. But those were high kicks. There we go. Why did I do that? Alright, just leave me alone. Just leave me alone. Let me suffer quietly. Oh my gosh. Oh, so much flipping around. Mamma mia. Alright, that's our traditional combo. Okay. Oh, what? Okay. Okay. I'm so confused. How did nothing? Let's go. Uh, that was kind of weird. I don't know what. Uh, I think I played myself. I wasn't sure what was going on. I don't want to fight this guy anymore. It's too confusing. Okay, cool. Okay. 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 Whew. Oh man, just a uh, my heart's beating. This game is not made for the faint of heart. Uh, dude, he's just I feel like he's just playing his own game. Okay. Oh. oh. Oh boy. Alright, he got me. This won't do a lot of damage. Whoa. Whoa. What just happened? I don't know what just happened. I think I got I think he created a field of magnetism and I got absorbed into his gravity. Gonna heat up some water? Okay, that's cool. Alright, I'm gonna quit this game. Alright, I'm gonna switch to Apex. Yeah, okay, I think I think it's the, I think it's the time to switch to Apex. Um, ooh, my ears. I might have to switch to over ear headphones because uh, my ears are. Ooh. Yeah, my ears are just. Ooh. All right, let's go make myself a nice coffee. I'll be back in a second.
Hey, Moose. Guess what, chicken butt? Hey, I've been okay. Sorry, um... Dang, I think I missed him. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna switch to uh, Apex. But uh, my coffee's still being brewed. All right, um, cool. This has been a cool coffee catch up break. I'm gonna go back to get my coffee. Okay, what I miss. All right, let's go ahead and actually switch controllers. Oh, my bad. So we're using the uh, Xbox Elite Series 2 controller. This hasn't been the first time I've streamed using that controller, but definitely been practicing with it. Uh, I feel like I have mixed feelings on the controller. It's very, um, on one side, it's cool because, you know, it's got the little triggers in the back. But on the downside, I feel like it cramps up your fingers more. I feel like my fingers just get so cramped up using this thing, it makes me not want to use it. Anybody else have that problem? Anybody else use a controller with a trick, uh, paddles in the back?
Besides, we both missing moose, not much. <laughs> All right, cool. Yeah, uh, I don't even know if this coffee was worth it, to be honest. Um, I just made it. It doesn't taste that good. We have a coffee machine, and I, I feel like every, um, like every other, uh, like every other, um, Like every other like fifth coffee, like it it comes out weird. Okay. So this is Apex Legends. Now nah, I'm a keyboard supremacist. <laughs> yeah, um Keyboard's cool, but here's the thing, you don't get aim assist with keyboard. I'd like to see you uh get aim assist. We'll try ranked. I, I like ranked because people tend to try hard a lot people tend to try hard a bit more in rank. I don't know. Um, let's see. Let's let's decide who we want to pick. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by the toe. If you catch him, let him go. Uh, I don't know who to pick. Oh yeah. Um, who should I pick? You have any recommendations, Grieber? You want to see me use anyone in particular? I'm a, I'm up okay, I'm gonna pick Rampart just because I can pretend I'm playing Fortnite for now, but next game. If anybody wants to see me uh pick someone else in particular, let me know. Yeah, so once again, the 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 Xbox controller, it's it's nice with the paddles and stuff. Um I think the the biggest issue with it though is the the hand cramping. I don't like that. And then also, um Uh I don't know. I feel like it could be a little bit more comfortable. Um, what the hell? Alright, let's see. Um, yeah, so, so, the, the key, one of the things the controller can do is, you know, you can make, uh, triggers. That's not a problem. You can do, uh, hair triggers. So you can basically reduce the dead zone. And that, that's cool, but the problem is that you can feel, like, the plastic of the trigger come close to, I feel like if, if you do that, then the, the, the plastic of the trigger feels like it's going to be more likely to break. And I don't like the feeling of that at all. Alright, we're going to land here. Actually, we're going to land in this house. Alright, cool. Alright, so we got a uh, real ill joker and reckless chili. Oh boy, I don't know how I feel about guys with names like this. Hey, what's up, Scribble Dip? Forgot to tag you. Aim assist, what's that? Oh, aim assist is this cool feature that lets controller players be better than keyboard players. And very, uh, in, situ in situational situations. Alright, so we got a peacekeeper, which is a sniper rifle. Uh, I mean, a peacekeeper, charge rifle. Uh, charge rifle isn't my, um, it's not the worst gun in the game, but it does require that you track. And tracking is very difficult on a controller. I still haven't. I, I still don't even know what the optical, the optimal controller settings are because this controller has way. What the fuck is this bullshit? Oh, I was just here. This controller, like you can change the bindings, but and you can change also the sensitivity of the sticks and the triggers. And I, I don't know if it's better to do it with or without it because once you start messing all that stuff that's usually fine-tuned by the game developer it gives you a weird feeling and you could probably find optimal controller settings but i feel like i'd have to spend like months or a year like really oh you're in one of my videos i forgot to tag you oh go ahead and um send me the is the video on your channel scribble dip because i'll check it out later yeah, I've been streaming a whole lot. I've been uh, busy working with stuff. And then Peacekeeper is just, you know, a regular shotgun. It does have this cool... Um, 
Uh, the Peacekeeper does have a cool uh, Terminator. Uh, when, when you're on a zip line, I believe the it has a, like a Terminator animation reload, which I think is actually really cool. Anyway, how you doing, Scribble Dip? I'm rocking the looks like the charge rifle and the Peacekeeper for this match. Usually, the way I play Apex, I like to use the first two guns I pick for the most part, and then I'll change a little bit. Just depends. I gotta say though, this map, the skyline of this map looks gorgeous. Like, look at that. Oh man, it's like something out of a Final Fantasy game. Oh, speaking of Final Fantasy, uh, Griever. So I was watching that Final Fantasy VI Let's Play that I mentioned last time. And they're right close to the end. They're at the end of the world, which is, you know, what happens after the Kefka stuff. And um, it's, 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 a, it's, it's when they're trying to recollect all the uh, party members. It, it's, it's very funny. It's very interesting. I can't believe the Yeti is part of the party. I can't believe the Yeti is part of the party. With that, oh, uh, what, what the fuck was Mog doing fucking around with a Yeti? That's that's what I want to know. Charge rifle is a free 2K. So uh like if you're trying to get the 2K badge, I guess. I don't know, man. It's just one, two, three. By the way, uh Scribble, if you want to see me play a different character, just put in the chat. I'll I'll next match I'll switch them. And this is ranked. I'm a bronze three, you know, three year bronze member gang. What's up? You know, you ain't a real Apex player unless you stick in it, unless you stay in your in your uh, in your rank for at least three years, right? This is ob obviously though. This is the worst um, disability for uh, an Apex controller player is the fact that you cannot when when you're looting you cannot move back and forth, and with the controller. I changed the binding so that you should be able to do that, and the game uh, on on console does not let you, which is such a bummer. What a missed opportunity! In the world of ruin, man, the game becomes kind of an open world ish adventure kind of thing. Yeah, it's really weird. I can't tell if there's like a certain order that you have to do things in. Um, it's kind of weird. It feels honestly almost like it's DLC or something. It feels like the game should have ended when you went to the city in the sky, and then the game just did not end and decided to keep on going. Yeah, it's very uh, weird. I don't know how to feel about it. But it is very open worldish for sure. Okay. Alright. Alright. Oh. Okay, cool. This, this is, oh yeah, this does add to your shields. That's pretty cool. So normally in Apex, when you do damage... Oh. You know, it, uh, it, I didn't know these things add to your shield. Well, man, dude, the Peacekeeper, sometimes it does a lot of damage. Sometimes it doesn't. Yeah, so this does... Oh, wait. So I have 546. Oh, it only adds a little bit. Okay. What do we got? Alright, cool. Yeah. Loot for Joker. Loot for Chili. Where the fuck is my joke? Okay. I was about to say, where's mine? Okay. Good. This is what I wanted. This is everything I kind of wanted, actually. Alright, so I just need a... Scope. Like, I need an actual real scope. Oh, there's a scope. Look at that. Look at these teammates, man. Best teammates in the world. No, not much of an order? Okay. Yeah, that's kind of what I figured. Uh, I can't believe you're still getting party members. I haven't, so, I've been, I got to the part where they got Realm, but I haven't gotten to the part where they get her granddad. So, um, the, don't spoil for me much, and then I still, I know they still need to get Terra, so... Because Terra refuses to get out of bed. Terra refuses to get out of her goddamn bed for whatever goddamn reason. Alright, cool. Let's see. Dude, why would you pick me up in the car and 
Let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. The circle's closing. Oh, uh, I guess we came to get our teammate. I know you subscribed to me when I filmed it. Okay, well, one day we'll, we'll find it. It's all good, man. Alright, so there's definitely been people here. Okay. Mm. Alright. Oh, wait. She's getting loot. Someone is here. Oh! Oh! Okay. Ah, oh, shit. Yep. Reloading. Okay. Ooh, whoa, that was crazy, man. Crazy. All right, let's uh, heal up real quick. Give me a sec. Can uh, go over there. All right, let's uh. Shit. Oh. Ah, shit. 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 God damn it. Ah, uh, nope, this is over. Ah, uh, darn it, teammates! Why would you do? Why would how? Why would you do me dirty like that? I blame my team. It's never my fault. It's always my team. They were holding me back. Did you know? Uh, I know you were playing Ash, and I think we had Rampart. You can get Terra early. That's what I did the first time I played. I got her with just Sap. Oh wow, really? I didn't know that. I'm not going to spoil it, but there's a whole subplot for Terra and also something for the old man. Mmm. So, yeah. Three things I want to get inside of uh, in Final Fantasy VI. Magitek armor. Kefka's Flying City. And Terra. In no particular order. <laughs> mm. <laughs> so do you do stream scribble or just your vids uh i think i went into him into a match but i think he just does vids i think specifically he does apex yeah um i also started watching uh, another uh, let's play of mass effect which is oh man i forget how much every time i see someone play mass effect i'm just like oh man i forgot how much I like this game. Mass Effect is so it's so fun watching someone who hasn't played Mass Effect play it. And what the cool thing about Mass Effect is that you play it as a teenager or like a young adult, and you're just like, oh, it's a fun game. And then you play it as a game a game as a as an adult who's aware of like you know politics as a whole, and you're just like, oh fuck, what are we doing? What are we doing, guys? All right, guys. You play it again as an adult, and you're just like, whoa, this game has, like, a lot of interesting themes that I wasn't previously aware of. Just It's okay. Uh, dibs. Thanks for stopping by, though. You could be anywhere else. You're here. That's uh, pretty cool. I'm still uh, trying to get better at live streaming, you know? Trying to get better at... Uh, making contact but that, that's the journey man that's part of the journey you live you you die you fail and then you just kind of start again all right all right cool so i would say like the benefits of playing on an elite series 2 controller is that you can do things like jump and aim at the same time or that you can just jump continuously and and also shoot you can't normally do that on just a regular uh, controller because of where the placement of the jump button is. 
Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Alright, we got a grenade. Alright, so are we gonna... Why did you scan? That's so deep. <laughs> You're of the two streamers I like. Uh, thank you, I think. Alright. Alright, I think we need to drop. Let's drop. Oh, they were... Oh, they did not. Oh. Ooh, first. Yeah, they were way too disorganized. You don't want to do that in this game. You don't want to, like, really split up like that. You really kind of do want to overpower with numbers if possible. You can totally divide and conquer, but you really kind of have to know the game well to be able to just pull off something like that. I hate looting on the, the console version because you cannot... You cannot look look at how long this is. It's like that snake eater vibe. Uh oh thanks a lot, uh dips. Um, you know, I uh definitely more of a variety streamer for sure. Don't know when I'm gonna get whenever I get back to a regular stream schedule, I'll I'll start streaming like single player games. I was playing um uh Fate Tactics, which is a fun fancy tactics uh kind of success spiritual successor sort of it's very low budget very indie but it, i was playing it last night for like an hour and i was like oh this is actually kind of fun i would definitely want to play this on stream at some point i kind of also wanted to finish drag quest 11 but man every time i start up drag quest 11 i'm just like god damn i need to play this game for like 30 more hours to finish i've i've put in 200 hours into dragon quest 11 and i'm just like i need to do 30 more hours and i think part of what makes dragon quest 11 sluggish for me is the music they don't have and unlike final fantasy which has like lots of remixes of a lot of songs dragon quest 11 doesn't have very many remixes of um of a lot of their songs it's kind of weird actually it's definitely dragon quest is definitely for the more hardcore rpg kind of guy gotta pick up titanfall too oh i i it's, it's in game pass i i have it i've not played the story yet though so don't spoil the story for me but uh it's fun yeah so i got to i think the second stage of fate tactics and then after that i called it uh quits i think i died a total of two times it's interesting though it's uh what the most interesting thing I think about fate tactics is how how at the beginning of the game within the first hour you basically have like a full ass party you have the dog the bird the girl and then like the two spirits that you can kind of add and i was just like god damn that's a lot of it's just a lot no fucking doubt we just saw them go up there oh bloodhound it's like we're engaging in a fight so I got a Mozambique Could be loot over here. Gotta look for something to save our lives. <sighs> I'm looking for attachments one uh specifically yeah actually yeah let me switch oh actually no the story is a man <laughs> <laughs> the sortie is a man's game. I wonder if they're gonna back over here. Cool. Ooh. What the fuck? I took the evil shield. Fucking asshole. What did he want? The helmet or something? I don't even have the helmet. We all have a blue helmet. What the fuck does he want? Yo, I hate Apex players are something else, man. They're just like, hey man, I pinged a gun for you, and then they'll punch you when you take the gun. Like, why the fuck did you take the gun? Extended like, mag here. Level four. like, I, I, I don't, I don't. Someone's coming. There's a danger afoot. Shit. Alright, I'm gonna go with the Bloodhound, because he's gonna have, 
at least he's gonna be able to spot kind of people over here if i stay with the lifeline we're just kind of blindly um, i'm blindly following a selfish rat is what i'm doing if i stay with the lifeline just a rat who decides to give me cheese and then get pissed off that i ate the cheese So guys, you don't want people like that in your life, guys. You don't want people that play that lifeline character. You want people that play the Bloodhound character. If you're at college and then someone tells you, oh, hey, guy, I play lifeline. Just be like, okay, well, fuck you. Don't be like, what the hell? He's like, okay, you cheeseless rat. <laughs> All right, uh, let's see where we're The studio that makes Fate Taxes else put out Valda Story. Oh, let me... All right, I'm going to Google Valda's story real quick. Uh, oh, is that the other game I wanted to try? There was a game that they had on Game Pass, but they took it out. Oh, no, no, that is I don't know what the game this is. The other games that I'm kind of excited for are like Paper Mario clones that, I, that are going to be releasing. They should have been released by now, but I think the pandemic slowed them down. I think they're releasing um, this fall. In arena lobbies. <laughs> oh shit. Why are you engaging? Why are you engaging? Go there. Alright, reloading. Dude, just scan. What do you... oh, Dude, we're gonna get Dude, we're gonna we're gonna get attacked here. Alright, go on the jump pad. Go on the jump pad. What do... oh, they just okay, they went all the way down. Let's get this gun out of here. What a waste. What a waste. Ah oh, man, we just wasted resources. Unfortunately, yeah. Okay. Let's just we can wait here. Throwing up some defense here, mates. Ramparts looking out. I feel like waiting. Buster is basically DMC meets Castlevania. Oh no, I don't think I would like that game. I'm not a big fan of Metroidvania games. I do like DMC a lot though. Uh, I have Devil Trigger on my MP3 player that I use uh, whenever I'm at the gym. <sighs> what a good song. What a good song. Dude, all these voices inside of my head. Okay. <sighs> what am I doing? Let's just go. Let's just go. We don't even need to fight this. We don't. Let's just go towards the circle. Why did you fall down there? One minute. Things close. Let did you set uh, you set up too hard? She looks scary. No, no, no. You always set up that hard. You go hard all the time. You don't want a hard rampart coming at you. <laughs> I mean, you do. <laughs> Nah, but um, it's you, you always want to set up hard. You want to have like seven. Oh shit! Someone's here. Oh shit! This is a bad spot. This is a really bad spot. We're about to get assaulted. Shit! All right, cool. This is cool and all, but I... oh shit! We got. We need to get the fuck out of here. Let's go. God damn it. Let's go. We gotta get out of here. God damn it. Okay, it's like I'm playing with Tweedledee and Tweedledum. Give me that ammo. Why can I not take it? Oh, because I have too many health items. Oh, shit. God damn it. Okay, cool. Alright. Oh boy, this is 
I listen to Devil Trigger a lot too. Dude, it's a good song. It's a, such a good song. Then V song is also pretty good. And then Dante's song is very eh. But I feel like, um, I don't know. Just oh, shit, man. This is bad. I think we should just set up in here. Oh god damn it! Oh boy. Oh boy. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no no. This sucks. Oh boy. Uh it's over. It's over. That was uh, too intense. That was too fast and furious. That was too quick. Oh, this lifeline did a really good job of healing up, though. Okay, so the, the third party is getting third party. Okay. Oh, boy. What are you doing? Okay, so you got my tag. Get in, get in, get in. Close the door. Okay, so one team just died. Okay, someone's getting revived as well. Oh, boy. Oh, nice. Alright, they should use a mobile respawn beacon if they have it, though. Because uh, at this late in the game, let me see. Yeah, there's only one spot where they can revive me at this late in the game. Whoa. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, I don't I don't think that I'm gonna get it revived, guys. I think this is it. Fifth party legends. Yeah, exactly. These are the fifth party baddies, that's what we call them. You don't want fifth party baddies showing up at your door. They're part of the after 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 party. No mobile respawn begin. All right, that's. I think I'm a. I think that's it for me. There's no way they can revive me, especially with nine squads left. I feel like that respawn beacon is probably already used up. Oh no, it's not. All right. Cool. Yeah. See, usually if this was me, I would probably hang out by the respawn beacon. That way, nobody can uh, revive. You know, I'm smart like I think maybe they're trying to go to the respawn beacon or something. Yeah, yeah. See, everyone's hanging out by the respawn beacon. Did they just trigger a revive? Yeah, somebody just triggered a revive. Yeah. Oh boy, let's see. This is crazy. It's wild. You're crazy, girl. You're crazy. Okay. They got the they got the uh Ooh, one more shot. Ah, uh, dude, she wants that kill. I mean Chef G uh, They want that kill. I don't know what to say. Ooh. That sounded like a really strong gun. Maybe a longbow or... Oh, uh, yeah. Don't, uh... Okay. This is an intense match, guys. You can't see it in my... You can't hear how intense it is in my voice, but... There's a lot of cool stuff going on. Seven squads is a lot, though. It feels like there's three just right here in this area. Okay, so there's someone hiding behind the rock. There's somebody, like, right in front of the two. 
Okay, they're by the fence. Oh, yeah, dude, dude, dude. No, no, he's right there. Okay. Yeah. Oh, boy. There's a... They should have go and attack. They should totally attack that person. Oh yeah, these guys are gonna carry me out of out of bronze. This 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 is what it is. This is what it's all about. You want to find yourself a sugar daddy. You want someone that can just carry you, <laughs> or a sugar legend, if you will. You want someone that's gonna be like, hey man, you, you want silver? You want silver? Yo, that. Bloodhound is thirsty for that care package. Yeah, what what's in that care package? Like? He's gonna ping something. Let's go this way. Forget that. Yeah, what is dude, what is Bloodhound doing? Yeah, what are you doing, dude? Oh my gosh, he fucked up. Dude, why did you do that? He's getting finished. Our Bloodhound is an idiot. I, I, I thought our Bloodhound was a smart person. I gave him the benefit of a doubt. But no, he's a moron. He's a, he's a wet napkin. What a goober. <laughs> oh my gosh. Why would he do that? I don't... <laughs> That, that is why you don't want to be like a thirsty looter, you know, because he this is end game at this point. You kind of have almost everything you need outside of like maybe gold and red items. So like he was like, nah, I want to check this care package. Oh, I want to also come in here. Oh, oh, she's he's got red shield, too. Oh, she can't. That's uh, it's over. Yeah, I mean, he's got what a devotion with a. With a turbocharger? It's over. Okay. Oh, no, no, it's a vault. Wow. Wow, what did I get, though? 160 points of damage. You know what we call that? Some people will say that's a little bit of damage for a whole game. Well, you know what I call it? I call it efficiency. It means I can go far with a little bit of damage. Okay, we're bronze. We're still three bronze in. Okay. Uh, I, I don't know who to be. I don't know who to be. All right. Oh, that was a cool banner for the Wraith. That's the champion squad. I ain't scared of them. They should be scared of me. All right. I'm the captain. All right. Well, I'm going to actually land in the blue area. The cool thing about landing in the blue area is that you can go to like a couple of you can kind of land uh if you survive then you're like it's kind of smooth sailing from there all right 38 Let's go. Oh boy! No, no, no! No! 
This is bad. Why would they let me go over there by myself? Oh. I can't believe they would have let me land there by myself. I don't know if the revive is even a good idea. Oh, I got scanned from behind. Shit. Shit. Oh! Ah! The third party! Third. Okay, you know, not the best jump. That's alright. That's A okay. We got points and we lose points. That's what we do with points. We win them and we lose them. Oh, we got somebody on mic. Okay, I might have to mute this guy's mic. This is, this it, it sounds like he's uh, scratching like fabric against a stereo. Why? Why does your microphone sound like that? Why would you why would you let your microphone get that bad? Night marks. 2059 is the spot. Really? Let me see. Where's the grid though? I don't see where it says 2059. What do you mean 2059? I'm, I'm confused. What's that? What do you mean by that? Is that like the time? All right. Oh boy. God, why are we landing here? <sighs> oh. Shit. All right, gun, 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 gun. No gun. He's the one shot. He's one shot. Oh boy. Come on. Shit. Let's get the fuck out of here. That's not a good spot, guys. Get out of there, dude. That's not a good spot. The, the one that died is telling me to get out of here. Leave the building. They're, they have high ground. All they have to do is throw grenades, and you won't be able to be able to get out of there. I'm sorry, Mr. Dead Person. Oh. 
Ah, shit. Wow. Shit. Ah. Oh my god, you're so bad. <laughs> he, he th he's the one that died! Why is he telling us that we're bad when he's the one that died? He died first. He has no right to speak. He has no right to speak. How dare he talks about my clan that way. I bet you he's the kind of guy that doesn't kiss his homies goodnight. He just screams, I don't kiss my homies goodnight. I can I can I can smell it. Okay. While my opponents are winning the match, I must study the blade. I must be one with the blade. I have to think of a plan. Survive. How will I survive? Okay. Let me see how many calories I have left in the day. I have to see how, how much more. Okay. Uh, I mean, we have enough for like one more meal. My number one fans watch. Oh, be fantastic. You realistic. Maybe I'll eat a hot pocket or something. Introducing your champion. My legs are ready to go. I'm assembly required. Oh, uh, you said ASMR. I'm a, I was about to say, like, uh, from clicking the controller. Um, okay, let's see. Oh, right, we're gonna go in here? Alright, cool. Let's go. We're going in the butthole. No 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 Oh they didn't go here why Oh screw this team out of here it's not how to get So we did come in. Okay, why did we land over there then? Okay. Ooh. I might. This is. This feels like a god tier. This seems, this seems pretty good. I mean, the dude rubbing a towel on his mic was doing ASMR. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Is it ASMR if a person is not uh, in a bikini, though? That's the real question. I'm asking the real questions, guys. Dude, I don't know how people are into ASMR, actually. Not to disrespect the ASMR crowd, it's just... Uh, the ASMR, to me, just seems so... Like, out there, in terms of, like... I don't know, like, hobbies you could like, I guess? Like, I don't... It's just... It's, it feels really... It feels like a really weird thing to enjoy. I don't know how people enjoy it. Um, 
Okay. Okay. Let's go. What makes you believe he was not wearing a bikini? That is a good question. I don't know what, um... Uh, th this is a question. This, you know what? This is Scrogginger's bikini. We went from Scrogginger's cat. Now this is Scrogginger's bikini. But we don't know if the person doing ASMR is or not doing a bikini. I mean, is or is not wearing a bikini. It sounds like someone just landed here. Yep, gotta go. Jump pad. Put out a jump pad. Now is the time to put out a jump pad. Alright, we're gonna go around the back. So that's open. Here we go. I don't know where he went. Humans are weird, man. Yeah, it's yeah, uh, it's it's definitely one of the weirder things for sure. They got a rampart. They have a rampart. Shit, I'm out. I'm gonna get. Rambling it, rambling it. Ah, oh, shit. Scan. I think if I punch this. Yeah. Shit, 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 shit. I don't know where he could be. I feel like I'm just running in circles here. This team is doing a really good job confusing me. This is, I don't know what to do here. Yeah, well, that's a crazy paradox. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what to do here. I wish he had a jump pad. Ah, oh, shit. Take up.
Where? Where did he go? Are you serious? He didn't want to go five. Yeah, this is, I don't know how I feel about this situation. This is a crazy ass situation. Oh boy. <sighs> Mother fricker. Oh my gosh. This is... Uh, yeah, we should have left a long time ago. This is such a bad situation. <sighs> yeah, now he leaves. Now he leaves. Yeah, well that's what happens uh, when... A big thing with Apex Legends is that you don't want to stick in a gunfight for too long. You know, things like this can absolutely happen. You just get wrecked. Yeah, so uh, the smart decision would have been to leave a long time ago. But hey, man, it is what it is. I think I'm going to do one more match after this, and I think I'm going to end the stream. It's 7.19. I'm starting to get a little bit tired. I kind of want to eat something. Then I'm just... uh. I just want to like relax a little bit. My ultimate's good to go. Have that banner. It's the least we could do. Okay. <laughs> Oh, they're right here to your left. Got to get shot. Okay, you got jump pad. Dude, just get out of there. Dude, if he hangs around, I lose my mind. Oh, he doesn't even have that much damage. He only has 100. That's crazy. Thought we would have had more. Oh, dude. It's round two is about to close. This circle is going to do serious damage. All right, you got a jump pad? Use your jump pad. Come on, man. Use your jump pad, take the long way around. Oh, I don't. Oh, he's. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I'm not paying attention. He's using uh, Mirage. That's fucking funny. This whole time, I'm like, use your jump pad, use your jump pad. He never had a jump pad. There he goes, there's the Octane. Oh, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. Don't focus on killing. Oh, no, actually, I don't I don't have, I have no right to tell him what to do because he's clearly still alive. 
Who am I to say things here? Okay, that's cool, but you need to heal. You need to heal. Yeah, he's gonna take the wall. Oh, he just took out the medkit? I don't know if he's gonna be able to. Hey, he got it. Throw a grenade in there. Throw a grenade. Dude, what are you doing? You're left. Oh, oh, he didn't see the guy to his left. That's crazy. He did good, though. He's definitely a team player. All right, last match. Last match. Come on, let's go. It's so weird to see the side profile of your face. Dude, oh, what an edge lord! What an edgy boy! I do not care who who does the kill. All I care is if I can fart in front of it. Okay, we're dro we're hot dropping. Okay, where's my teammates gonna go? What the hell? Oh my gosh, the, my down teammate was in the way. All right, I'm gonna do one more. That was too quick. Ah, uh, that was annoying. I couldn't. I wish he wasn't in the way. I feel like uh, that you should. Ah, uh, that's kind of a bummer. But he was in the way. <laughs> Our path is, made today. 
Is it though? Oh, is this the same dude? <laughs> that is a blunt edge lord if I ever saw one. Nah, he totally is, man. He totally rips it 420, blazes it to that one um, 30 Seconds to Mars song. Here we go. Carry me, carry me. All right, let's see. Taking note of my techniques will benefit you. No. Oh. I just want to end the the night on a good game, you know. You know what I mean? I don't want I don't want to I want a good game. I want a I want a GG. I don't want a BG. I don't want a bad game. I want a good game. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's go. Separate. All right, I'm gonna go right here. Oh, yep. This is great, but I don't I don't want another gun. Oh, you know what? L star. Oh shit. God damn it. Oh my gosh. This is bad. So we got two people. Oh, need to attack one of these guys like we can't just uh stick around here <sighs> come on we gotta we need to make a push somewhere oh my gosh <sighs> these guys don't want to If they don't want to push, I can at least kind of fight cover fire. Dude, where did they go? Why are they leaving me here? <sighs> why? I'm so. Why? Why? Why, why would they leave me here? That's not fine. No, get, what are we doing? Alright, charge, charge. Come on. Do a cell battery time. Let's go. Alright, alright, 
that's enough. That's enough of that. Let's go. Let's go. I like how they're finally pushing, though. No, 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 no. Ooh. Fine. Okay. Oh, he's so low. Ah, oh, I completely missed. I went out like Rambo, though. Oh, man. We should have pushed when they were fighting. But hey, man, you can't win them all, and that's ranked is what ranked is, right? Okay. Let's take these off, because these are starting to bug me. Ooh, did, I, I don't even know if I had a net increase. Either way, that was uh, pretty good. That was fun. Fun stream. I might stream again tomorrow. Don't know what, though. Just because I'm not working tomorrow. So, uh, actually, I probably will stream more than likely. I just don't know why. But anyway, um, yeah, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Uh, this was a lot of fun. Uh, I kind of want to play again DOA tomorrow. DOA is so much fun to play. Uh, like, it really is. But I don't know. It's also fun. In general, there's fate tactics. Let me see what's on the game pass. What can we play? Okay, I got um I, I don't want to play a story heavy game. That's my biggest issue right now. There's so many story based games I wanna play. And most multiplayer games like uh, are shooters, which is kind of annoying because it's like, and it'd be cool to have a something that's not a shooter. Because like for me, it's like shooters and fighting games, shooters and fighting games. I don't know. That's a lot of years of war. I mean, the Hades is a good game. Oh, Halo Infinite Lone Wolves. Oh, Life is Strange True Colors is on there. But once again, I don't really want to put start a story-based game. 